What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. This reading here is for my Scorpio Zodiac signs. We're going to run through another reading for you. Let's see if she'll cooperate, okay? <laughs> see if she'll cooperate. All right. Little mama, what deck? Yeah. Let's do uh, spell casting. All right. She getting heavy, y'all. All right, let's do spell casting deck. All right, spirit. What do we have for Scorpio? Three cards. Messages for Scorpio. Messages for Scorpio. We have peace. Okay. Two more. Messages for Scorpio. Woo! <laughs> Prosperity. Hey. Okay. Messages for Scorpio. Messages for Scorpio. And justice. All right now. Hey, hey, hey. Oh my gosh, I just thought of Missy Elliott. Hey, 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 now what's happening? Mm. <laughs> okay, and dreams, bottom of the deck. I just heard your dreams will come true. Some of y'all could be getting downloads here, okay? You're being guided towards something. You're going to be stepping into a lot of energy of peace here, especially when it comes to like your money, your happiness, your abundance in some sort of way. A lot of y'all are about to be at peace with things. This is, oh, sorry. This is the scales balancing out here. This is justice being served. This is something that is owed to you here, especially if you've been in this um, in this energy of like chaos, like things just not going your way, things not happening the way that they should. Yeah, family. Some of y'all, this has to do with like your family life. We have answers here too. A lot of y'all are getting messages and downloads through your dream state about like it could it could be. Some of y'all are dealing with like uh, generational curses or you know, generational things, why certain things had to happen in the family dynamic or why certain people act the way that they do in the family dynamic. Uh, a lot of y'all are like the key to the to unlock these answers. Or y'all are like the key to break generational curses here. This could be like maybe being the first person to go to, go to a college, being the first person to start a business in your family. Uh, being the first millionaire in your family, you know, stuff like that. Being the first person to have all three girls. I don't know. Something like that, okay? <laughs> Let's see. What's at the top? Animals, compassion, and strength. Okay. A lot of y'all, y'all may be noticing that animals are coming up to you or like uh, animals are attracted to you in some sort of way. And like it, it's, it's your energy. It's your aura, okay, when it comes to this animals card. It's your energy and aura. The compassion card, yeah, and strength. They feel this this presence about you, like you, how you show compassion, how you show love, you know, because you're in this higher vibration. Animals understand that. There's two full moons here, three, three full moons here. So it could be something going on with the next full moon. I don't know if it's some sort of cleanse and, and, and strength and confidence that comes with it, but some sort of transformation. Or you may be seeing things transform from now into the next full moon here. Or something. It could have to do with your money. Something that's owed to you. Uh oh Yeah, and there's another full moon too. Something with the full moon. Okay. Or something that's hidden that you can't quite see yet. It could be something that's hidden that you can't quite see yet. You're thinking like, oh, is this going to work? Is it going to work out? And it actually is. It's justice is going to play out for you on your behalf. Uh, what are you doing, Missy? Let me see if I can put her down. Hold on one second. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can clarify this energy. Clarify the peace card, please, Spirit, for Scorpio. What's this peace card about for my Scorpios? Clarify peace for Scorpios. Mature woman. Okay, so a lot of y'all are maturing. You're growing. You're realizing the more mature you are, the more mature you handle a situation. Yeah, main female at the bottom of the deck. Or the more you um, handle a situation, the more at peace things are. This could also be maybe you may be gaining some sort of peace with um, an older woman in the family here. <clears throat> the more mature you handle situations. Some of y'all, there could be like another female that's involved and it could be like causing a lot of disruption, a lot of problems in a family dynamic here, we have the spare mature man adjudication. Whew. And somebody may be finding out it's because of this, this person, this male, this masculine energy. Yeah, bad health it has been the one that's been causing the uproar. Ooh, child. Mm, a messy man, honey. Nothing worse than a messy man. <laughs> I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. Men can be messy too. I'm just saying, woo, they be more messy than women. 
on it, okay? <laughs> What's prosperity? <laughs> oh my goodness, concern. So somebody is worried about either their prosperity, this could be you, or somebody else is worried about somebody else's prosperity, abundance. Yeah, official person. Somebody could be an official person or somebody could work in like the government. Um, or this could have to do with like a divorce, a separation. We have marriage, an official person. Somebody could be worried about their money due to that. Family room, journey, privilege, lady. Oh, somebody is like worried about somebody. Somebody is in somebody else's business when it comes to their money, finances, and career. Honey, with this family room, journey, and privilege, lady. This could be somebody, you know, say somebody's going through a divorce, a separation, or something. Somebody's becoming single, or somebody's leaving a relationship, and they're concerned. Oh, oh my gosh, if this person's single, I don't have their money anymore. I don't have the stability that this person wants. Uh, provided me with in this family dynamic the family and journey could also be like you know a good lifestyle like journey like uh traveling living good living a good life you know somebody's worried about this about this privileged lady yeah imprisonment honey they want to keep this person trapped or they want to make them stay in this mental blockage of some sort adjudication high honor some somebody's trying to keep somebody trapped or like this could be like their finances too within prison somebody's trying to keep somebody's finances trapped or like locked up or try to keep somebody locked up in a situation because they know this person is supposed to be high honor is supposed to be well respected admired honey the adjudication with the high honor if this goes to court it looks like whoever this privileged lady is like they're going to take that person's side somebody's concerned or worried about that that could be what the justice is Unexpected income on the bottom of the deck. Somebody could be trying to, you know, like play it out. Like it could be actually the, the masculine energy that's doing wrong. And somebody's trying to play it out like it's this mature woman or something. And I don't know, honey. What's the justice? Ooh. Journey. I'm telling you. Somebody's on a journey here. Distant horizon. Somebody's been creating illusions here with this distant horizons card. And then it's like something in the future. Like now that something's moving, like something's about to be balanced out. And there, there can't be any more illusions. Like something's going to be seen for what it truly is. Courthouse, message, expectation. Yeah, this could be like documents, paperwork, thief. Somebody going to be seeing this. Somebody been stealing. Somebody been stealing. Somebody been taking advantage of another person with this thief card. Somebody's worried about this. Yeah, thoughts. And somebody's in their head about it. Like, oh my God, I, I, house. Could have to do with the home, a stability, toil and labor, some sort of work, marriage. I'm telling you. And poverty. Somebody, it's like, if this is a relationship or a connection or some sort of job contract or something like that, somebody is going to find out that somebody's been stealing. And this is justice. This is fair. This is justice playing out. Somebody's going to realize somebody's been stealing. Somebody's been taking advantage of somebody or like losing this relationship or losing this connection it means they're at a loss for finances. Like they're really going to be left out in the cold. Like they're not, they're not going to have the house, the, the money. Everything that they were once taken from somebody, they're not going to have that anymore because the law is about to get involved or something like that. Something's about to be seen for what it truly is, like especially if, if this is like a lawsuit or a divorce, a separation or child support or something like that. Somebody's going to be seeing who's been the responsible one and who's not and who's actually been taken from the other person. Okay, let's see. What's the piece with the mature woman or Scorpio? Nine of Pentacles. Yeah. Somebody been messing with Queen of Cups. Somebody, okay, so somebody's intuition. Somebody could have been taking advantage of somebody too with this Queen of Cups energy. This is like someone very loving, caring, very intuitive. But Eight of Swords, somebody's in Seven of Pentacles. King of Pentacles. Somebody is stuck in their head about this Queen of Cups. This King of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles. This have to, oh, and then there's a King of Swords and Ten of, honey, what is going on? Justice, Ten of Swords, King of Swords, King of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, Queen of Cups. Somebody knows something ain't right. Somebody's stuck in their head about two people, two masculines. One could be getting a divorce, wanting to invest, or one could be cutting off this Ten of Pentacles, cutting, getting a uh, getting a divorce and going towards another connection. They could be stuck in their head about it here. They could be leaving behind everything. I don't like this. Tempers, five of swords, seven of swords, ace of wands. Somebody's being manipulative, conniving, sneaky, winning at all costs in order to gain balance in the situation here to have a new start with this ace of wands. And it could have something to do with this mature woman's energy or money or finances or stability. This is like somebody stealing from somebody else in order to make their life more comfortable to have this brand new beginning. 
it's going to, honey, justice going to play out. What's prosperity for Scorpio? Knight of Cups. Somebody, yeah, somebody could be love bombing somebody. The hangman. Somebody needs to see something from a different. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. The devil, ten of wands, five of pentacles, and the hangman. Somebody needs to see. This is why somebody's concerned. Because somebody's going to see that somebody's toxic with this burden here. Somebody is, somebody's going to be taking on their own burdens. Like they can no longer try to project this on somebody else. If this, if this is mature woman or whatever, they can't put that on that woman no more. Or that man, whatever. Okay, flip the rolls if you need it. But somebody's concerned about this, especially with this Knight of Cups. This could be like somebody love bombing somebody like, oh, yeah, I'm successful. I'm financially stable. I'm this and I'm that. But really, they've been living off of somebody else. You see what I'm saying? It's it's toxic. It's um, a lot. It could be obsessive as well. It's like somebody is ta taking their whole load and bringing it. Seven of Cups, Ace of Cups, because it's an illusion of this Ace of Cups. It, it could be like somebody saying like. Somebody can't see something. Somebody can't see the moon. There's something hidden behind this, this new beginning, this new love offer. This could be somebody saying that they were with this one person. Oh, this person was a bad person. Da, 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 da. They were actually taking care of that person, financially supporting that person. And then they go offer love to another person, but it's around illusions. They may not know the reason why they're offering this cup of love. And it could be because their finances are messed up. It could be because they're not stable, as stable as they claim to be, you know, Somebody needs to look at something here because something ain't what it appears to be. Somebody, this is love bombing energy. What's justice? Eight of wands. It's coming in. The lovers. This is choice too. And somebody going to get to choose if they're going to take this journey with this person or not with this eight of wands energy. And that's justice. Yeah, knight of pentacles. It's been slow coming. The magician. It's been slow coming, but somebody get to make a choice. Do I take this leap of faith? Do I work with this person or not? Yeah, three of pentacles, page of wands, and the tower. The information about to come in. The Empress, because some, baby, somebody been taking page of swords. Somebody is realizing that that somebody is like taking from another person. Like somebody's gonna be seeing it for what it is. If somebody, whoever this is, that's been taking advantage of this Empress energy, that's been taking advantage of this person, causing tower moments in this person's life, delaying this person in some sort of way, it's about to come out. That's somebody's justice. This could be like if somebody's been trying to like hinder the growth of a relationship with another person or stop somebody from going towards somebody or doing something for somebody something like that honey it's, it's about to come out just it's about to be served like if somebody been lying cheating stealing trying to make it seem like there's somebody they're not to keep somebody from going on to another person i'm telling you it's about to come out and somebody gonna be like oh no uh -uh. what's peace with mature woman what's this about could have to do with a pregnancy as well peace and mature woman Nine of Pentacles. Oh, three of them. Oh, my goodness. Parenting, focusing on your children, co-parenting, setting the record straight, and destroy. Shatter, broken, effed up. This could have to do with some sort of uh, co-parenting relationship, a single parent here. If you're not a single parent, this this could just be like somebody could have been saying like, oh, you're childish. Oh, you're this, you're that. You're the one causing ruckus and drama and stuff like that. And you're over here at peace, minding your own business. And somebody was trying to destroy you. Or somebody was trying to destroy your peace. You know what I'm saying? You over here minding your business, doing your own thing. Yeah, keeping you a secret. Doing your own thing. And somebody trying to destroy your peace. Bugaboo. Keeping a promise. This could be a bugaboo energy. Somebody that's not even uh, their true authentic self. Okay? Somebody that's, yeah, riding it out. Somebody feels like they got to ride something out because they made somebody a promise. Like, okay, well, yeah, I'll be over here. I'll do this. I'll do this for you. And now somebody feels, oh, somebody feels stuck to it. Like they're stuck in it. You know, already knowing the T, insecure, game over, and keeping you a secret. This is somebody who was very insecure, didn't want to, like, admit to something being at, end, being at an end or this, that they lost at something. It's like somebody wanted to keep that a secret. Or somebody made a bad deal, a bad move. I don't know. Prosperity with concern. Doing drugs. This is, yeah, somebody was overindulging here. Somebody over manipulated the situation. Red lips exchange, evidence of cheating. This could have been, like, you know, somebody just wanted to, like, cheat, have fun, you know, you know lay around in that stuff but really they didn't they didn't want they didn't want to like be there forever depression bad choices and staying centered aligning yourself with the universe now that somebody's seeing something from a higher perspective like the third eye is opening they're they're vibing higher they're starting to see like this isn't where i want to be at somebody may be like at a loss of money a loss of a lot of things like and they're realizing like i don't i didn't want to be committed or i didn't want to be in a relationship 
I just wanted to, yeah, sex shop, tantric sex. I just wanted to, you know, sports, a player. This could have been a player energy. Somebody that just wanted to have some fun. They didn't mean for it to go this far. And now they kind of like wishing they wouldn't have love bomb because now they're like their whole their whole abundance, like the whole life is is at a loss here. 15, 15 on the phone. Yeah, mama. What's justice with journey? Fake friends. This is somebody pretending to be like your friend, pretending to like you. Total drama. This person could have caused a lot of drama in your life. Oh, my God. Getting a room. Check yourself. This could have been like a workplace affair or something like that. Can I have another one? Justice with the journey card. Police. Yeah, I'm telling you, justice is going to be served. Some of y'all just has to do with the law, with this police card. Mm, nightmare. It's, it's Yeah, it's a big nightmare for somebody. Caution and attracting. Somebody could have attracted a low vibrational energy and it's like destroying everything. GM, this could have been somebody sleeping with somebody at work, sleeping with somebody on the side, recording announcement, expression, revealing. This could have been outed. Somebody could have found out about this fake apology. Somebody could be apologizing about this, sick, but it's making them sick. Knowing they effed up. This is somebody knowing that they messed up. They never should have. It's like they never should have did this or they never should have went this route. They feel like it's just everything's getting destroyed for them. Because of the choice they made. But again, you know, we all have free will. It's choices. There's choices in everything. We choose to do certain things. We choose to take certain actions. And there's um, results. What's the peace with the mature woman? Peace, spirit. Peace with the mature woman. Ghosted. Yeah, somebody could have ghosted somebody here. Somebody could have made peace with somebody being ghosted or being in and out. Low IQ. Somebody was very low vibrational. Not thinking about their actions here. And somebody is, is like... They're at peace with being single, being, you know, in solitude, like being by themselves, basically. Being in a single's energy. What's peace with mature woman? We have romantic love affair, sex fix, secret love, F buddy. Yeah. And then acting cold. Somebody could be emotionless now. Like somebody may not be, may not have emotions here, may not want to do that. You know, they just want to like co-parent. They don't want to do anything else. Yeah, too busy winning because they life could be going good for them. They don't want to be like wrapped up in a situation here. Maybe they feel like somebody's toxic. Yeah, bad habits and then kissing butt. Maybe they feel like somebody's toxic. Somebody, yeah, no facts. Somebody could have told a lot of lies on somebody, spread a lot of lies about them here, used them, creativity muncher, and rejected. Yeah, used them, took advantage of them now, and now they could be rejecting them. Oh, child. Whew. Block. Somebody could be wanting to block somebody because somebody's winning. Prosperity with concern. What's that about? Honey, it's karmic friend. Dodging bullets. Yeah. Somebody went towards something that they probably should have dodged. Karmic friends. They could have been listening to their friends here. Bankrupt. Yeah. And it's, it's whatever it was, it was bad advice. It was bad advice. Prosperity and concern. Marrying for money. They got with somebody because of money or it's being seen that somebody was only dealing with somebody because of money, because of finances. Fishing for comments, kissing butt, yeah. Bad, I'm telling you, bad habits. Somebody could be looking on Facebook or looking on social media. And somebody's post, divination abuser, low IQ, creeping. And groupie, this was somebody wanting attention, manipulating situations here. They could have been abusing tarot, you know, getting multiple tarot readings on somebody here. Somebody was creeping around with somebody on the side here. And it's like, honey, it's just, it's messing everything up. Like, somebody's now realizing, like, this was not the way to go what's justice with the journey somebody's justice with the journey card please spirit what's justice with the journey card so somebody was in their ego big ego trip scarcity tactics yeah and now somebody's at a loss here bad reputation ego and an offer somebody could have offered something to someone based off of the ego okay and the, the sad thing is they ruined their reputation by doing this, like by getting this offer or going towards this, this situation here. So it's like, you know, things are having a balance out here. Somebody could be losing a lot. Fake smiles. They're pretending to be happy. They're at a loss of a lot of stuff. They could have been just confused. Ain't ish. Somebody finding out that somebody ain't ish. Ugh, somebody was wasting time. Unfazed. Boss daddy. Wants you back. This could have to do with like, honey... Somebody could have been a time waster. Somebody's unfazed. Like somebody didn't want to change, didn't want to evolve. So somebody's unfazed about it now. Like, okay, you don't want to be in a relationship. You don't want to be in connection. Cool. I'm going to go on by my life. And then this boss daddy wants you back. Now it could be like somebody ready to step up, ready to, to be that person that somebody needs them to be here. But it's after like they've lost everything. Love triangle, bad karma. 
And it's like somebody got involved with a third party, dirt digging out, you know, somebody could be digging up dirt about this person, getting information about this person, extra trick, and it's triggering somebody. Incarcerate, somebody stuck in the head, they've been in and out, girl fight is causing drama. Somebody could be at war competing. Yeah, they're crying. Now somebody's crying, they're hurt, they're upset about this. They wish they never did it. It's like somebody trying to find out who is this person, who is this, who is it, like trying to get information. But this is somebody's karma that they did this based off of ego. They let ego kind of guide them to whatever this is. It was just like a bad choice. It was somebody was being quite selfish, like overindulgent, like one in their cake, eating everybody else's. You know, what's the peace with mature woman? Stuff like that. Past love, in the past, past lover, dating, wanting, dining, and romance. This could be somebody, you know, from their past life, or this could be an ex. Somebody could be wanting to go back to their ex. Long distance. They may live at a distance from this person. True love, pure love, honest connection. Yeah, this could be somebody wanting to go back to their ex or like wanting to date their ex again, but they feel like they've messed everything up already. Like they feel like they can't go back because this person just wants to be single now. They don't want to be bothered by nobody. Control, yeah. Releasing, taking back power, kinky in the bedroom. <clears throat> this could have been somebody very controlling. Yeah, mature woman is here. Social light connector, high society. This could have been somebody very controlling, wanting attention from this mature person or wanting to sleep with them here. What's the prosperity? What's the concern part? Family, yeah. Origin, soul family, and groups. This could have to do with a family dynamic or a kid could have came about this. Young male, sporty cars, youthful. Or something about the family dynamic. Somebody could have been like trying to control a family dynamic as well. Short-term, quick playing, endings, and time. Whatever this was, is turning out to be like a short-term thing. Mature woman. And children. Yeah, it could have to do with a, a, a person with children or somebody just wanted to have fun with somebody. Like they didn't plan on spending happily ever after with this person. What's justice for journey? Dating queen. Opportunities, dates, and abundance. Oh, wow, money. Now somebody can be seen as somebody's very financially stable, very wealthy. Yeah, obstacles, blocks, pathways, and delays. Friendship. Okay, so somebody could be getting friends out. <laughs> I just seen two, 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 two. Friends, acquaintances, and networking. Somebody could be getting friends out. It's like somebody is now stepping into, it's like if somebody, okay, if somebody was stuck on a past person or somebody didn't want to mature and grow up and like give this, give whoever this is, whether this is you or whatever, the right commitment like they could have used you took advantage of you you know or they went out exploring elsewhere they didn't want to commit they were non-committal that type of energy they just wanted to, to be a sex thing right you could be saying to yourself like okay well you know what it's time for me to open up to new opportunities accept an offer from another person or maybe see if see what else is out there because maybe you felt like this person has been holding you back this person could be upset now because now you're releasing those blockages and those delays because this person took too long they took too long. You may be friend zoning them. Yeah, this is karma playing out. This person could have played with you for a very long time. And it's like, now they ready to offer some. We have dark mail, darker than lighter. Now, yeah, gifts, surprise, surprises, presents, and openings. And true, yeah, valuable quality and jewelry. Some of y'all may be opening up to like a new person, ready to date somebody new. Like you're, you're like, okay, well, you know what? I'm going to go out there and see what else is out there, what else is available. Because this person, they kind of just, they played with you. They toyed with you. They toyed with you, whether it was holding on to somebody from the past or like holding on to past situations, like not wanting to open up, not wanting to date you, not really wanting to like date you properly. It's kind of like they left you single too long. They played with you. It's kind of like, you know, you have food on your plate. You play with your food long enough. It's going to get cold. You no, know, now somebody's cold. They kind of like, I don't even have feelings no more. Oh, so somebody could be getting friends all. Give me one more. That's sad, y'all. What's the justice? But it's fair. What's the justice card? Gossip. Yeah, neighbors, small talk, grapevine. They could have listened to other people. This could have kept them from like pursuing this new love. Yeah, this new love opportunity. Young male, they wanted to be out there. Yeah, they had to go through some sort of growth here. They had to go through growth. Young male, sporty cars, youthful, spiritual growth, learning, expanding the soul, twin flame, spiritual alignment, effortless and karmic, and fair male. Lighter than darker. Whoever this person was, they wanted to be young and free. They wanted to go out there and party. This person could be going through some sort of spiritual growth, dark night of the soul, getting into alignment and realizing like, okay, you know, seeing the light now, realizing like, oh my gosh, this is like my person. This is who I really want to be with. Like I want to 
I want to actually offer them something. I don't want them to date nobody else. Like, I'm actually in love with this person. But you can live at a distance from this person. This person could have put you in a third-party situation here. You know, you you could be... Some of y'all, y'all work from home or, like, you... You make good money where you have like freedom to come and do as you want, or you're just single where like you can, you're freely to do whatever you want because they put you in a third party situation anyway. And you're kind of like, oh, I'm just going to go on and explore and see what else is out there. Some of y'all are opening up to new love now or a new love opportunity because you're like, this person played with you. But okay. Anyway, I'm going to leave it there. Hope this brings you some clarity and some insight. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.